This is a very compelling story. Uh, 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 and also there is a, a, a very positive message. If you read book in a way, you, you read, you, read uh, you, you are free or you, you try to be free. And what's important, uh, the, uh, let's say the, in quotes, of course, the message of the movie in order to accept the rules. I think that um, storytelling, literature, um, culture, the arts, it's where we derive our sense of humanity from um, and it, what it is to be a civilized human being um, and to show respect for our fellow human beings. And it's, it's absolutely essential to the survival of the human race. Otherwise, we, we just become animals and kill each other um, very quickly. I think it's, you know, education and literature and storytelling are, are, are um, a safety a safety against extremism um, and ignorance and prejudice. Well, I think <coughs> books are really important. I like the message because um, kids our age are so much into Internet and iPads and, you know, they, they don't really read a book on, in real books anymore. Even at school, it's always on computers. And I like that people, if they see the movie, they tr maybe try to pick up a real book again. I personally prefer real books. I like the smell of them and to have to turn the pages myself. But I think it's important to read books because, you know, it, like in the movie, it makes you see the world in a different way with words. And, and it makes you see that in every bad situation, there's always good. And, you know, Liesl doesn't have a lot in her life, but she uses these little things that she has to make extraordinary bigger things. Of course, you approached you. You did a, a lot of movies, and uh, uh, but is there any responsibility toward a story like this? Because mm, I mean, even though it's novel, it's a, a true mm -hmm. period of time, a true story. And nowadays, unfortunately, we still have morals all over the world that uh, the, uh, um, are uh, anti-Semitist. So, was your approach different to the, the, these characters, to the stories? I think there is a sense that you have to be very respectful of the real story. And we were very lucky to film this in Berlin. So we were surrounded by the real story in all the museums and the exhibits, and the, but also the crew and the, and the sense of historical accuracy um, amongst just the physical world of the film um, was very important. But also there was a sense of, after a while, at, at first I wasn't able to do, but after a while I was able to ask some of the other actors about their family. Um, you know, what did your parents or grandparents do in the war? And it was a very painful question to answer and very private, but um, it made it feel very real. Sorry, what was no, the for, for you, uh, do you feel any pressure, any sense of responsibility to, to, the, to this character? Um, maybe a little bit. Actually, I was a bit stressed that they, that these, because I was playing with big actors and I was thought, I was a bit scared that they'd think I'm a bad actress, but also because, um, also if I, I was scared that if I do a bad job, then the whole movie's going to be bad. And I kind of felt that I had to do a good job just to remember all the people that died and, in just to, it was a kind of way, I don't know, I felt like I had to do good and also because, I really wanted to do the movie. I wanted to my because I wanted my friends to go and see the movie, so that they'd learn a bit more about what happened. And it was just kind of the case because I went to see it with my whole hockey team and with my uh, friends, and all after they went, to, I, I said, "If you don't understand, you can always go see these movies." And they all did. And they came back the next hockey practice, and they were like, "Oh my God, I didn't know that." all this happened and that showed me how people my age don't really know about what happened and I kind of was happy that I made the, the movie so that even more kids my age can know now what happened. So this is a proof that in a way cinema, cinema can change the world, no, maybe not say but still uh, uh, talk to a single mm -hmm. person in order to, to change things. Mm -hmm. I, think, I think that's true, I think it, it's very powerful too. So it, um, it was, was important for your friend to, to see a, a story like this, I mean, to, to, um, to access this, this material to, uh, in order to understand. Mm -hmm. And also because I like that it's not, the book thief is not a Holocaust movie. 
it's more the story about a little girl living through the Second World War. And I think that's what it really attracted young people is that it's told by, I mean, the narrator's death, but I mean, the story is about a young girl. So it attracts more young people to go and see the movie, which is interesting.